Good morning, friends. It is Monday, November 4th, 2019. It is a new and exciting week. Um, let's go over what the week has in store for us. So today is Monday. We have Learning Lab from 1 to 3. So please stop on out for some homework help, uh, someone to sit with while you do your schoolwork. I'll be here all day, so come on out and see me. Tomorrow is Tuesday, so we do have check-ins. I have Blake at 815, Bentley at 835 with Mason, Lane at 9, Stephen at 1010, Benicia at 1030, Livy at 1140, Aiden at noon, Aaliyah at 1220, Dominic at 110, Cassidy at 130, TJ at 215, Gabby and Harmony at 235, Caleb and Kendall at 315. I have Aiden Shirk on Thursday during Learning Lab, and I have Devin on Friday at 2. That is our set schedule. If you need to change it, please let me know as soon as possible so that we can arrange that. Uh, Check-ins are very important. They let me know how you're doing. We can go over any questions that you have. Uh, and they count towards your attendance, which is very, very important. I have many kiddos missing out on attendance points because they are not coming to their check-ins. So please make sure that this is a top priority. Wednesday at noon, we have our Live Connects You lesson. And this week, we will, um, we will be having show and tell as requested by my kiddos who attended last week. So you can bring anything to show and tell. And as a bonus, you can bring a candy or a treat that you received on trick-or-treating that you'd like to share with your friends. On Thursday, we have Learning Lab again, one to three. So please come out to that. As of right now, nothing going on on Friday. Um, but we do have a free day weekend coming up. Monday, it's Veterans Day, so we do not have class. You can do schoolwork if you wish, but you can also take the day off. And please remember to thank a veteran for their service. Um, sometimes we forget why we have holidays, and this is a very special holiday for those who have served or who currently are serving and will become a veteran one day. So please thank a soldier. And a few other things to go over. I will share my screen. In our Connects You class, um, on Tuesday at midnight, which is tomorrow, your week 10 assignments are due. So please make sure that you have those turned in by tomorrow at midnight. And don't forget to check out our bonus features. We have important reminders like activity signups and advocating for school choice. Um, how to, the November edition will be up soon. Helpful resources. We still have our circle of trust touchstones, but I've also added the link for the help desk for technology. So if you click on this link, this is where you can submit a help desk ticket if you're having a technology problem. So easy access for you. Children's events, as always, I've been adding to this. Um, so we have our events for November. I put them all in a Google Doc and the ones that have um, passed on no longer that time of year, I put them at the bottom. So their recent is at the top. So this Wednesday at the Bethlehem location, Barnes and Noble, um, there will be a children's story time. Thursday and Friday at Penn State Altoona, the Ivy Side Dance Ensemble will be putting on a performance. Um, it is free for kids under 12, adults at $7. On Friday into Saturday, I'm going to show you a flyer here. The Altoona Library will be having a stuffed animal sleepover. So on Friday between 8.30 and 3, you can drop your stuffed animal off at the library and see what happens when your stuffed animals are left alone at the library at night. And on Saturday, you can come back to pick up your stuffed animal and enjoy a breakfast snack while you watch Toy Story 4 with your stuffed animal. So you do have to register, but this is a really cool thing. If you ever wondered what happens and if uh, real life is like Toy Story, this is a cool opportunity. Also on Saturday at the Bethlehem uh, Barnes & Noble, there will be uh, story time, uh, author signing and a demo day. Saturday, more locally, there is the fourth annual MAC Charity Con. This is Mount Aloysius, my alma mater, will be holding a Comet Con for charity. 
It is a free entry and free kiddo events. You can go dressed up as your favorite superhero, princess, pirate, prince, animal, dress up, have fun. It's like trick or treat all over again. So those are the things happening this week, but I do have events all throughout November and starting in December. You can check those out. And then story time, new stories recently added. We have Orange You Glad It's Halloween, Amber Brown, How Big Could Your Pumpkin Grow, The Little Orange House, Goodbye Summer, Hello Autumn, The Ugly Pumpkin, and The Conclusion to Narnia. Also, um, tomorrow is an important day for grown-ups because it is voting day. So anyone over the age 18 can vote, and I'd like to give you the opportunity to vote. So grown-ups have until I believe nine o'clock tomorrow to vote. Um, so I'm going to give you until midnight to vote tomorrow uh, on which chapter book we should read next. So there is a video describing your choices and then a Google form for you to complete to pick which one you'd like for me to read next. So please do that by tomorrow at midnight, have your voice heard and we will begin reading a new book now that we finish Narnia. And also another reminder that your assignments for art and health and PE are now available and they are due by December 3rd. So you have a day less than a month to get these completed, but do not wait until that month is up to submit these assignments. Um, you're going to make a pan flute and write an original song for the arts. And then for health, you will learn about the skeleton and make your own x-ray. And for PE, you will participate in a physical activity and then do a little project to go with it. And the only other thing I believe I have for you at this moment is a reminder that grades were put in on Friday so you should be receiving your report cards very shortly. And if you have any questions about those grades, please just let me know. And I think that's it. So have a great day, friends.